First at 10 tonight, a Vietnam veteran memorial was held at Briar Creek Lake in Berwick to honor those who served in the Vietnam War. This is Columbia County's first celebration of Nas National Vietnam War Veterans Day, which fell on March 29th of this year. Fox 56's Alicia Hercules was at the memorial and tells us more about the ceremony. Today, Vietnam veterans, their families, and other veterans gathered together to pay homage and honor those who were lost in the Vietnam War and those who survived. Eleven markers with Vietnam veterans' names surround the flagpole. Ten of the veterans died during the war, with one returning home but dying shortly after as a result of their injuries. Despite high winds and rain, many people showed up to the event, which Columbia County Commissioner David Kovach says is a joy to see as many paid their respects. Good for everybody that took the time and braved the cold weather because that's what us, the citizens of the country need to do. We need to remember our veterans and what they gave up for us so that we can be here to do what we did today. The Columbia County Commissioners held this event to continue to honor Vietnam veterans, especially after the treatment they received when they first came home. The treatment we got when we came back, even from other veterans, was nil. George Pfeiffer, a Marine Corps veteran who served in Vietnam for three tours, says this memorial has a special meaning for him and his family. My brother is one of the markers over there. He was killed in Vietnam in 69. So that's one of the reasons I'm out here. Pfeiffer and Rod Hess, a veteran of the United States Air Force, say they now dedicate themselves to attending events like these and will continue to advocate for all service members to ensure they get the help and honor they deserve. I get more out of giving back to places like this than I ever got from the government. So. The Vietnam veterans I spoke with today say that they hope to continue to see more events held to honor them and their service. Reporting from Berwick in Columbia County, I'm Alicia Hercules of Fox 56 News, first to 10. To learn more about Berwick's military history, a restored Stewart tank is scheduled to make its way throughout the borough, starting off at City Hall at 1 p.m. tomorrow. All eyes.